of kids from the Boys and Girls Club of Stanton connect with Time Warner to learn how cable television operates. Reporter Natasha Paul shows us if the kids can crack the codes. These middle school kids aren't setting up for laser tag. They're learning about cable signals. Time Warner's Connect a Million Minds volunteer project reaches out to young kids by helping them connect their math and science skills to the use of cable TV. I like math and it uses math a lot and it'll like tell you a lot about math and how solar panels work and how a spinner can work just by using the sun. After touring the brains of the operation, the kids enjoy hands-on displays to make learning fun and easy. Kids participated in demonstrations on energy conversion from light to wind to cracking binary codes. They're teaching us about how their shows get on by binary codes and they have like satellites in space so they can receive codes. This satellite exhibit was a popular one with the kids. In this demonstration, I am Time Warner's head end and the camera represents the satellite which is 22,300 miles above the equator in a geosynchronous orbit. It helps to keep the communication clear from the satellite to our head and if there's any disturbance in the signal, it'll break transmission and that's what causes the pixelation and loss of transmission. Time Warner's Director of Community Affairs, John Borak, believes this initiative is important to give these kids the knowledge they will need later in life. We hope that by the time they leave today, they'll have a little bit more knowledge in um, science, technology, engineering, and math, and kind of know what we do as a company and how the signal gets to them uh, when they're watching TV at their home. I'm Natasha Paul, reporting.